was I did a little bit of fishing after the unboxing of me showing the lures. Y'all can watch the uh, fishing part. Then at the end, I... Well, looky here. Mystery tack box just came in the mail. Wonder what could it be? And it's unopened. I'm fixing to open it up right now. Got some goodies in here. Okay. What's inside your box? Here's the card. Let's see what's in first. Lucky John. Arain Arainrar. Whatever you want to call it. Get off of there. Anera, Anera, and it's a uh, small little crappie uh, crankbait, and it's in fire fire tiger color. By here I am inspecting it. It's uh, designed in Japan, so as you can see there, it has a pretty good little spoon bill, and I imagine this is like a small deep diver type bait. Pretty cool looking. And that's price for $8.99. Next one is the Berkeley Power Bait Crappie Nibbles. And color is blue neon. Don't say uh, scent. Crappie Nibbles. These go for $4.29. Next up is Cream Silverside Marabou Min Minnow. Silverside Yellow Feather Greenback Minnow. Oh yeah, these should work just fine. Those go for $179. Next one is Northland Tackle. And this is the uh, Glow Shot Spoon. And it's priced at $6.99. Then the last one is Komal Tackle Round Clip on Float. Basically all it is uh, a weighted uh, round orange bobber. And that goes for 179 As well you get your sticker. And plus your tattoo. And this will include the uh, mystery tackle box for December 2017. This is the uh, panfish edition.
Hey, how y'all doing? Okay, here's the fishing part right now. Got one. Got a small bass. Look at there. Got a small bass on this little jerk bait. God. Small bass on this little jerk bait. Uh, on this little crankbait, crappie crank. Not jerkbait, but crappie crank. Small little bass. Small little largey. On this guy right here. Little bluegill. Look at that. Little bluegill. That ain't bad at all. Little bluegill. Okay. This is how I, uh, whenever I caught that bass. I was just throwing this thing like a crankbait. Basically, that's all it is, just crankbait. I know I said jerkbait because I, I was doing a little bit of jerking as well. Pause and jerk. Just mix matching. Then the bobber, the cream jig oh let me get it here this is how I was throwing it right here had the bobber had the jig basically what I was doing was whenever I throw it out I also had it tipped with the uh, power bait crappie nib nibbles where I th was throwing it out I had it where it settled like this then I would pop it that way as soon as I pop it this jig come up then I let it settle back down again and that's a good way how to get a good re reaction strike and in the uh, glow, uh, what is it? Northland glow shot spoon. I didn't really get nothing off of this one. Uh, they weren't really into it. I was tipping it with uh, the crappie nibbles. They weren't too into it. The only problem I had with that is the glow sticks would not glow they were bad really bad glow sticks but yeah and if you're gonna if whoever got the same uh, little crankbait in their uh, panfish box make sure you uh, tip your line with uh, Split shots, a couple of split shots, make it dive deeper and help it out. And here's a uh, little clip how I was rigging the uh, bobber, how I was fishing the bobber in the uh, jig right here or right here, whichever way it's going to come. But yeah, I'll let y'all watch that. This box wasn't a complete slam, but it was pretty damn close. Pretty damn close. Uh, like always, please comment. Please uh, hit that like button. And please, please, 
subscri uh, subscribe for more. And I'll see y'all later. Oh yeah, one last thing. Shut up and fish. Bye.